Hello, this is Suzanne from 120 Crayons, and um, this is like the third time I have done this intro because I had this video uploaded, and I had cool music with all those pictures that you just watched, and then it was blocked. And uh, those pictures I put up because in reply to Jesse's question, um, <clears throat> what would our dream house look like, and uh, I chose Rivendell. Slash Lothlorien, slash the Grey Havens, pretty much just elven places in Middle Earth. So uh, those are those are what I chose. Sorry about the the silence. Jesse had mentioned that our friends Ed and Alice will probably be joining us soon, and I think that's pretty cool. We'll be able to do like a full like chat type thing instead of me and Jesse sitting around like having cameos in each other's vlogs like like uh, I did in her earlier one and I'm glad that she left that one in because the last vlog that she did I had a cameo in that and she took it out I mean come on Peter Jackson had a cameo in each Lord of the Rings movies yeah if you uh if you know which scenes though scenes those were you know you should let me know in the comments um we'll see if you're right um, you'll probably be right, because, I mean, if you were willing to take a guess, then you probably know already, which means that you probably watched all of the, uh, special features like I have, <laughs> and, uh, that's commendable. I'm proud of you guys. But, uh, anyways, yeah, my answer to Jesse's question about what is our dream house is Rivendell, because it's beautiful, and it has so much history, and like elegance but it also has fun like in the Lord of the Rings movies you never really saw how fun the elves are but if you read the books like they're always joking around and playing sarcastic jokes and pranks on all of their visitors and stuff I think it's pretty cool so uh I love elves pretty much if I were in Lord of the Rings I admittedly I'd probably be just a human but I would want to be an elf <laughs> um though I have to admit if I were going to be a human, I would be part of the Rohirrim, not from Gondor, because the Rohirrim are cool. They're more like Vikings, like the Saxons, except not as main, I guess. <laughs> I would hope, at least. I'd, I'm pretty sure the Rohirrim didn't go around raping and pillaging everything. But, uh, yeah, I like their, they're more, like, earthy, and they... <clears throat> they, like, have more respect for natural things, you know? Which I think is pretty cool. And so, yeah, I would be able to row here if I couldn't be an elf. And after that, I'd be a hobbit, because I love to eat. And, you know, hobbits just have a good time. And who wouldn't want to be a hobbit, seriously? I mean, they got it made, you know? Um. So that's, that's the question I'm going to ask you guys, you know? But if you could be any of the races from uh, Lord of the Rings, you know, elves, dwarves, men, hobbits, ants, wizards, anything you can think of from Lord of the Rings, orcs, if you wanted, um, which one would you be and why? And uh, I think that's a good conversation starter. <laughs> I mean, if I were on a first date, I would start a conversation like that. So I guess that's all that I really had to talk about for this vlog. Um, I could tell you about my weekend, but honestly, I did nothing. I went to work, and then I sat around and watched internet videos and stuff. I mean, one thing cool that I did do, though, is I watched um, Stick Aid for a long time, which was a charity event put on by a couple of UK bloggers. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way. Um, I was gonna open this vlog with, uh, Country Girl by Black Sabbath. That was before Jesse asked that question and I, you know, decided what to answer it with. But my reason for, uh, for choosing that song is because when I do my hair, these little pigtail thingies, and I wear my plaid shirts, I look like a country girl. So my theme song when I dress like this is Country Girl by Black Sabbath. Maybe I'll close with that. You guys are probably tired of watching me put pictures to music. <laughs> but it's going to happen every single vlog, so be prepared.
And, uh, you know, if you don't like it, don't watch. But watch, because that's cool. <laughs> so hopefully by the time I make my next vlog, uh, Ed and Alice will have posted some. So I'll have more to reply to. And uh, that's it for today. Bye!